people make decisions every day. Uh, for example, before you go outside, you kind of have an if statement that says, if it's raining, then I need to get my jacket. And computers are amazing once you decide those kinds of statements that they can reliably execute those things at unbelievable speed. And so a computer program really uh, is a little bit of math and some if statements uh, where the decision gets made. So in, in this puzzle, the if block helps the zombie make a decision. Right. It checks something. For example, let's use the block that says, if there's a path to the left, and put a turn left command inside it. So we're telling the zombie to check its surroundings, see if there's that path on the left, and if so, make that turn. And then we use the move forward block inside this repeat uh, to get it to keep moving forward as long as it just wants to go straight. Uh, then when there's the turn, the if block will tell it to make this turn to the left. And you can see if we do that, if we're taking the turns to the left and otherwise moving forward, we'll achieve our goal. So it's an example of using an if statement, which is really a, a fundamental concept in computer programming. Uh, one of the first things I learned was uh, uh, how to write a program to play tic-tac-toe. And you know, so I had if statements to say, OK, if the other person is about to win, go ahead and, and block that uh, spot. Uh, so have fun learning how to use if statements. It's a, a key concept.